If I could ask you just about uh, something that you testified about the public protector yesterday, uh, and um, you uh, expressed some concern with the way that the public protector dealt with the investigation and your role and function in that whole investigation. Uh, perhaps you can just explain to the chair <coughs> what had happened uh, and what was it that made you concern, uh, raised your concerns concerning the, uh, the public protector's uh, investigation. Okay. No, I think the, the reason we're all sitting here today at the State Capture Commission is based on the findings of the public protector report. Um, the various role players that have had to come and testify, I mean, that's, that's not what I'm getting into, but some of us have been integral to those investigations. We've sit here um, alleged of all sorts of wrongdoing, corruption, bribery. You know, it's been going on almost on a daily basis from about three years ago. So what I would have expected was a, a fair opportunity to represent or reflect on, on my side of the story like I'm doing here um, yesterday and today. I didn't get that opportunity. Um, was communication sent to me? Yes, it was. Sorry, can I just ask you, um, perhaps just pointed questions. Mm -hmm. Were you invited uh, to the public protector? This was towards the tail end, from a time frame perspective towards the tail end, time-wise, uh, okay. but before the tail end, meaning before the report was finalized. Um, I was traveling at the time, I'd received a phone call. I forget the, the lady's name that they called. And she said she's from the public protector's office. And she was checking if I'd received community just to come and sit and have a discussion, um, an interview, um, and just to get to your side of the story and the, and, and the version of events. And I said, cool, I'll check that. Check the, the email, and indeed there was an email. Um, Following up, and this was a very short period after the phone call and the email, I received a summons or a subpoena of some sort um, to appear urgently. Uh, and the discussion that I'd had with the, the representative from the public protector's office is, I'm not in the country currently, I'm conducting business. Um, I'm not living in South Africa any longer at, at, at that time. So I'll need time, and when I get back, I will look you up and I'll come in and present myself. So that was uh, the, the version, the, the sequence of events. And before I could even make those decisions, there was a, um, a finalized report that had come out. Now the reason I'd raised it yesterday is, obviously, um, I'm sitting here today. Um, I've been mentioned in all sorts of lights. I, I didn't have an opportunity to, to give my, my version of events. And the basis of that report is what this whole State Capture Commission is about. Um, I'm sitting here to, having to answer all sorts of allegations that could have been answered at that point. Did, you, uh, did the public protector make available to you um, the versions of other persons, such as Mr. Jonas, perhaps? No. Uh, I, for you to respond to it? I did not receive any uh, notices, I didn't receive any uh, transcripts. That was, everything I've seen has been post, um, post the, 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 the finalizing of a report.